Hello everyone, welcome to the ninth part of my Gary's Mod Lua tutorial series. Today we are going to be going over HUD Paint. And this uh, quick part, what we're going to do is we're just going to get started with drawing in HUD Paint. And then in the future parts, we're going to go ahead and actually piece together an actual HUD. So to begin, what we're going to do is we're going to use hooks. We're going to do hook that add. We're going to hook onto HUD Paint. This function gets called every single frame so we can draw things. Um, I'm just going to say my add on HUD and then function and then end. So now inside of here, inside this hook, we can draw stuff on the screen. Um, so something to keep in mind whenever you're working with um, HUD Paint or really any of your um, VGUI, you're gonna wanna keep in mind that certain players play on different resolutions. So to account for that, instead of drawing rectangles or really anything at um, with a specific pixel count, for example, like a rectangle that's 100 pixels wide, 20 pixels tall, um, you want to use percentages of the screen width and screen height. So how that works is um, we're going to create uh, two variables. So it's going to be called SCRW, which is going to represent our screen width, and then SCRH, which is going to be representing our screen height. We're going to call the function SCRW and then the function SCR height. So this returns the value in pixels of the screen's width. This is going to return the value in pixels of the screen height. And now this is really nice because, for example, if I'm playing on 1920 by 1080 and someone is playing on, uh, I don't know, 1280 by 720, um, if we're multiplying these values by a fraction, it'll be persistent in terms of how it looks on both resolutions. So I'm going to draw a box, or no, a rectangle that is in the center of the screen. So begin. We're going to do is we're going to set a draw color so we're going to be using the surface library and if you guys aren't familiar with the surface library it's right here we have a bunch of functions you just go ahead and type surface up here you can see all the results we're going to be using the draw rect and set draw color um, so we're going to set the draw color and i'm going to make this a little bit of a transparent black rectangle so that's going to set the draw color for us then anything that i draw after this is going to have this color so I'm going to say surface.drawRect. And this time I want this rectangle to be 25% um, of the screen width and 10% of the screen height. So to do that, first we're going to have to set our positions. But we're going to want to store these variables in, um, or sorry, not these variables, these values in a variable. So I'm going to say box width and box height. And we're going to set that to SR width times 0.25 so this is going to take the screen width and take 25 percent of it and we're going to set that box height to scr height times 0.1 so now this is getting 10 percent of the screen height so to get this in the center of the screen the first thing we need to do is do scr width divided by two so we know that hey we have our width of our screen we're going to divide that by two so boom we're right in this in the center then we're going to do the same thing with the height scr height divided by two then we're going to do box w and then box height so this is going to set the rectangle to these variables which is going to be 25 percent and then 10 percent screen height so go ahead and save this and now you can see we have this rectangle that is starting at the center of our screen but it isn't so much positioned in the center so to do that all we need to do is offset the x position and the y position based on the box width and box height that's why i put it in a variable up here so what we can do is we can subtract to move it backwards. We're going to take that box width um, and then we're going to uh, divide it. Don't have to put it in parentheses. Box width and we're going to divide it by two. And we're going to go ahead and save it. And now you can see, boom, it's in the center. And now with the height, what we're going to want to do is subtract the box height, divide it by two. Go ahead and save it now. Boom, our rectangle is perfectly dead center in the screen. And if someone was on a different resolution and they were to join, they would have this rectangle on their screen as well. Um, so that's just a quick example of how to paint something on the HUD. Uh, next part, we're going to go into actually making a nice little health bar in the uh, bottom of our screen. So yeah, um, if you guys have any questions, as always, uh, comment down below and like and subscribe. I appreciate it, guys. Take care.